the American Dream TV, Charlotte Lake Norman edition. I'm Melissa Zimmerman and I'm gonna be your host today. Today I'm gonna let you in on a little secret about this fantastic Lake Norman area and take you to some of the local hot spots. Today I'll be taking you to a new build artisan home located on the shores of Lake Norman in Cornelius, North Carolina. Come with me. I just absolutely love your new house. It is absolutely a to die for view. This is a main channel of all main channel views. Yes, we totally fell in love. We joined the peninsula over here and we can go by boat, by jet ski to go play golf, play tennis, grab dinner. Um, you're super close to the interstate, to Charlotte. So it is a fabulous location on water and on land. When you were building your home, how much did outdoor space influence how you were gonna build the coastal feel of the house? Oh, like 100%. When we met with our architect, I told him I wanted to have the biggest porch as I could because we were gonna be outside, hopefully 95% of the time. So oh, it had never, everything to do with it. I would never be inside if I had that. Wow, Gina, this view is just to die for. Thank you, we love it so much. We're here every night watching the sunsets. Congratulations to your new lake home on Lake Norman. Awesome. And to having me over all the time. Absolutely, cheers. We're gonna go meet up with my friend, Joe Lynn and have lunch at Hello Sailor. And that way we can talk a little bit about the history of Lake Norman and what it was like to live here before the lake was actually built. There's no better way to get there than by boat. So let's go. I'd stop real quick to show you the Peninsula Golf Course. One of the best things about living on Lake Norman is the Lake Norman lifestyle. Even though we're only 30 minutes from uptown Charlotte, it's like living in vacation all the time. You can be a member of the country club and live in one of the premier neighborhoods, such as the Point and the Peninsula, which have golf course accommodations and country clubs to them. Or you can just live on the lake, have a boat, kayak, paddleboard, jet ski, tube, sail, anything you want. Sailor continues to be one of Lake Norman's favorite restaurants, not just because you can park your boat at the restaurant and drive over on the lake, but also because of the tiki bar behind it and the cool 1950s Palm Springs, California vibe mixed with the North Carolina Calabash feel. If you're not sure what a fish camp is and a Calabash feel, North Carolina loves their fried seafood. So the Calabash style shrimp and the hush puppies are always favorites. Hey, Jolyn, thanks so much for meeting with me to have drinks. I really appreciate it. I can't even imagine the city of Charlotte without Lake Norman, and the fact that you lived here before it was even built just is mind-boggling to me. <laughs> I, I just assumed that it just flooded overnight, and to find out it took over two years to flood just amazed me. Did you watch it as it progressed, or did you guys all wait until the very end to come to it? We waited until it was finished to come up. I also heard that you could buy a lot for $300 yeah. for a waterfront lot. Did your family get in on that? Well, unfortunately not, Melissa. <laughs> My father did, later on, purchase a lease lot through Crescent, I believe it was. So when you had a leasehold or a lease lot, did you get it for just like five years, 10 years, or? Oh no, it was like a 999 year. Please tell me you still have that lot. <laughs> no. Oh, well, Jalyn, I appreciate you meeting me for drinks today. Oh, I'm yes. always fascinated about Lake Norman and the history behind it. Growing up on one of the Great Lakes and moving to a man-made lake is just so different. It's just mind-boggling to think of the work that went into it. So I, cheers to whoever designed Lake Norman. <laughs> cheers. Thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed getting a look at that fantastic lake property that we explored and also the great restaurant at Hello Sailor. Next time you're in the area, please make sure to stop by Hello Sailor and see all that it has to offer. Until next time, that's Melissa Zimmerman for American Dream TV. See you soon.